I'm out with a thermal imaging camera um, because we had reports of some tawny owl chicks um, in a wood where we've placed a tawny owl and a barn owl box and we have confirmed there is a, at least one tawny owl chick fledged and um, it's calling for food and the adult male owl is calling as well with his typical Ooh. call so the thermal imaging camera has shown off both of them really amazing little device to have Wait, did you hear? That's her. Mm. So that's the female call. That's, that's the way to it. Yeah. Oh, so we can't hear it, but possibly the baby is now calling back. There's a baby over here calling. Oh, really? Okay. So there's at least two of them. And he's moving. Well, I think there could be the male calling to it. Could be Wick as well. Can you hear the baby clearly? Yeah. yeah, up here, yeah. Okay, okay. Can so, you? Yeah, it's just, but just on the edge of my hearing, unfortunately. It's I can hear it quite well. Yeah, I can yeah. hear him really. I can hear him moving too, to the to the right. So a few of them now are using the Kiwik call, which could be the youngsters have learned that too. But this call up here to the left is a, a feeding begging call. The kind of high-pitched mm -hmm. kind of call. So have we got anything so far to suggest there's more than one young? Um, here she's coming to me this way. Potentially, um, there's potentially four owls, there's definitely three. If the male didn't move when he gave her this rodent, then there's a fourth in the end. Hold that. Yeah. It's on pause or go. We're also just checking one of our barn owl boxes here because we've had a report that there's been a barn owl screeching nearby um, around half seven, eight o'clock each evening recently. Um, the infrared camera has shown something really interesting, which is the floor of the box on the right hand side is warm as if something is sitting inside the box. Um, how will we know? We won't. Um, but it's really interesting to see that the floor of the box is warm in one spot. Fingers crossed for an incubating barn owl. Okay, I am very, very excited because I've just come back the day after we scoped out the tawny owls with the thermal imaging camera. And I have found, I think their nest site, but definitely their roost site. There's an adult below and a chick above. And it's the first time I've ever found a tawny owl in daylight. I've seen them a couple of times at night time, but I've never got a good view of a tawny owl in daylight. And I am thrilled. It's sitting right here, top of a tree, looking down at me, and it is beautiful.